What is going on guys? Welcome to the No Way Out pay-per-view. Let's jump right in from Boston, Massachusetts. It's Chris Jericho's got his match. Jim Ross and Jerry Lawler. Jim, what do you have for us tonight? Way out live on pay-per-view. Good old JR, Jim Ross and Jerry the King Lawler here in Boston where the action promises to be exciting in Beantown. I heard Chris Jericho is ready to expose the identity of the masked man. The majority of fans think Mr. Kennedy did it with 31% of the vote. No, we're Boston. not going to stall. So we're going to choose. Uh, somebody said do both versions, and I actually somewhat agreed with that. So before I do, I want to make sure we hit save, but in a second spot. That way I have it at the No Way Out pay-per-view. Make sure we know which branching one is which one. So let's hit save. And let's go ahead and choose our suspect list. Now, the first one I'm going to do is if I think it's Randy Orton the most, right? I think it's Randy Orton. I want uh, to face Randy Orton at WrestleMania because that's like the big build. So for this branching version, we're going with Mr. Kennedy. We're not going to waste any time. We're going to jump right in and see what we can do against Mr. Kennedy because, that, like, that, like I said, that's the thing. If I'm thinking WrestleMania build-wise... I want to face a guy like uh, Kennedy now and prove it's not For him. For weeks now, someone has been trying to get under my skin like a rash. First with code, then with sneak attacks. Kennedy, I found the masked man's mask in your bag. You cost me the WWE Championship. And somehow you got your own little title shot tonight. If you think I'm going to sit down for that, you better get that swelled head of yours checked. Get out here! Wait, Kennedy got a title shot? Uh-oh, here he comes. But he's supposed to have a championship match tonight, JR. So, Kennedy is supposed to have a championship match. I wonder if then Randy Orton fills in and Randy's the champion and it's a swerve all along. Randy was using Mr. Kennedy. Get up. I hope Mr. Kennedy's got a no, he reversed it. He has a signature and a finisher now. I like how we just lost that, and we, we had it perfectly set up to like win the match. I don't know if we're supposed to win, if he's supposed to win. I have no idea, but Jericho is going to give it his all. Nope. <laughs> Come on. Why can't you just run in the right direction? As Kennedy's finisher is staying around a long time. It should have been uh, shut off by now. As Kennedy's going to drop. There we go. All right. It, it dropped off. We want to make sure that... I don't know if this is like a KO thing. I don't know if this is uh, what we have to do to win. Because I don't see a referee. As Chris Jericho runs right into the corner. Kennedy's able to shut him down. And Chris Jericho strikes back with a wicked forearm to the face. The slap across the chest and down to the mat goes Mr. Kennedy. As you can see, Chris Jericho, look at his eyes. The intensity. He's pissed off that uh, Mr. Kennedy cost him his opportunity. The masked man at the previous pay-per-view, the Royal Rumble, would cost him his opportunity at the title. And Kennedy firing out wicked clothesline, taking down Chris Jericho to the mat. But Chris Jericho is going to send Mr. Kennedy outside of the ring. And a big boot and off of the apron goes Mr. Kennedy now on the outside. Chris Jericho running with a neckbreaker. Now, Kennedy does have a title shot later tonight, so it's a little conspicuous that clearing Chris Jericho out allows the guy that we're facing, the guy that we called out tonight, to essentially be the number one contender. What a coincidence. Maybe, in fact, it wasn't Randy Orton. As uh, That was a nice shot. Maybe it was not Randy Orton, although I still think it looks the most like Randy Orton. That's Chris Jericho again. With a versatile big running bulldog. Look at that sequence. Is Chris Jericho taking time to gloat? But Chris, I don't know how smart that is. Kennedy's off the ropes. Jericho's able to take him down. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What happened? We got a cutscene. Okay, so maybe we weren't supposed to uh, win or do something. It's supposed to like turn into a cutscene. I was kind of hoping we could keep uh, going on to that match as the loading. I don't know what's happening. It's loading super slow. Let's listen to Jim Ross and Jerry Lawler. All right, the second I say that, they stop talking. All right, so we got to wait for this to look. Somebody get in there and stop these two. Good God, 
Chris. Look behind you. Oh. It looks like Jericho accused the wrong person, and it cost him dear. Not to mention ruining the main event at No Way Out. I think there's going to be hell to pay all around. So, wait. Who's still the champion? Because obviously Kennedy didn't get his opportunity. I, I'm a little confused now. <laughs> so let's save the bottom one to make sure we know uh, choosing Mr. Kennedy uh, is that one. So we'll save there. And then we'll eventually try to go back and do Randy Orton's part. And uh, see if there's any difference. We're from Washington, D.C. As I knew it was Randy Orton. So we called out Mr. Kennedy. It wasn't that. That was the, the slight. The feud. Everything going on. We got the pyro. So Raw is live from Washington, D.C. Let's send it over to Jim Ross and Jerry Lawler to find out what we have tonight, Jim. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Monday Night Raw. Last week, Chris Jericho's accusation threw a wrench in the championship match at No Way Out. He thought he was doing the right thing, but so does the Black Widow Spider. Due to the interruption, Shane McMahon has declared there will be a WWE Championship match tonight. John Cena and Randy Orton will go at it live. What an announcement. I'm sure Jericho isn't going to be happy. So Mr. Kennedy had an opportunity, the mind games of Randy Orton, to essentially get us to turn on Kennedy who had a title match that night. We attacked him. We got attacked from behind with a steel pipe, and now Randy Orton gets a title match? Yeah, this is no coincidence, Randy. I know you're behind this, Randy. Take the night off, Chris. Because of your little stunt, I had to do damage control, and I'm in no mood for more antics. Yeah, you know what, Shane? I, I know this is a screw job. I, I know what's going on right now. It's pretty obvious. Shane can keep me from competing, but he can't keep me out of the ring. I'm going to go out in the championship match. Randy Orton is not getting my title shot. Well, I, I think he may, though, Chris. I don't, I don't see how we stop him, so to speak, from winning. I, I don't see that happening because then there's just going to be a... Uh... All right, so what I was trying to say was, I don't think, because then Shane will just put us in a match. It'll, he'll protect it. And the opponent, the WWE Champion, John Cena. So now it makes sense for John Cena to uh, drop the title. He'd be a transitional champion because the feud has been Mass Man versus Jericho this whole build. But then my question is, who does John Cena face at WrestleMania if that's the direction they decide to go? Because usually you would drop the title at some way like No Way Out, and you would have a pivot for John Cena. And right now, John Cena does not have a pivot. Oh, there's Jericho. What on earth is Chris, Jericho Chris Jericho's here. We're gonna DQ him with a roll up. <laughs> Come on, you can't DQ him with a roll up pin, bro. All right, let me go get a weapon. I wanna hit a chair shot on him. Randy, you wanted this. I'm causing a DQ. So John Cena gets to keep his title. So either one of us gets screwed out of a title opportunity, essentially. Randy Orton with a chair shot to the head. Down goes Randy. Look at the body of Randy Orton. It's a two on one beatdown. Cena's not a part of it, though. Look at John Cena. He's so confused. He retains his title, though. So, I think John wins. Jericho just got the WWE Champion disqualified. He may have made an enemy in Cena, and that's not someone you want mad at you. Wait, why is Randy's... Well, I guess technically Randy did win via DQ. Okay. So as we move on, let's make sure we save the right spot. Chris Jericho, week number nine. Yes, let's hit save. And let's uh, move on because 
I want to. I, now I'm curious to see what happened in the other part as we move on to Charlotte, North Carolina. We're at the Hardy's hometown. Ric Flair. Woo! From Charlotte. Look at this pyro. Welcome live from Charlotte, North Carolina. We're going to send it over to Jerry Lawler and Jim Ross. Jim. Welcome to another exciting night of Raw. The bad blood between Jericho and Cena is starting to boil over. John Cena seemed pretty upset about last week's disqualification. He's not one to forgive and forget. I bet dollars to chicken fried steak that these two are going to butt heads soon. Okay, I get that, like, because John Cena has the never give up attitude. He wants a a match. He he's giving people opportunity. But this, the thing that I'm a little confused about is he he's he won. I mean, he lost, but he retained his title, and he's mad because Chris Jericho. Raw is certifiably out of control, ladies and gentlemen. People are interfering left and right. We got some guy running around in camouflage. But this isn't the desert or the jungle. We can see you. Wait, who's talking? I can't see him. But he didn't mess with my match last week. No, that was you, Chris Jericho. I want you out here right now. You can't mess with him if he's the guy in the ring. You're so vain, Cena. What I did last week didn't involve you, Junior. I lost my chance to be WWE Champion, and I'm just trying to make things right. If it involves the WWE Championship, it does involve me. When you get involved in my matches, it involves me. Seems like you like getting involved in my business. Well, if you want some, come get some. That sounds like a great idea. John Cena versus Chris Jericho tonight. In a non-title match. We've got ourselves a blockbuster of a main event, folks. So we have a non-title match. So again, we're weakening down each other for Randy Orton. Kennedy was supposed to have a match. We stopped it. Look at everything that's happened and this build to Road to WrestleMania so far. We're going to be back in the next part with more of Chris Jericho's Road to WrestleMania as we head in. We are three weeks away from the WrestleMania pay-per-view. Until next time, it's your boy, Tavi Thank you so much for watching, and we will see you all later.